It is our code, our creed, our shield. I even keep secrets from myself. I had my memories suppressed, so that nothing I know could be used against the Dark Lady. Once I prove myself, my memories will be restored. I'm not sorry I kept this from you. Not one bit. Though, perhaps that might change, if you can show an open mind. Talk to me later. We've got more pressing matters to see to right now. Oi! Ain't no party in here! Shay it, Graw! Olak cleared us. Got a visitor for the drow, I do. My ass. What's a true soul want with any mate of yours? Private business, that is. Raiding business. But if anyone wants a piss pot guarded, we'll call. Just get your friend branded proper. Right, Sazza? Got better things to do than... No, you don't. Come on, then. Bloody racket. They're just having a bit of fun. Oi, so much fun. More oh, vile idolatry. Here, the absolute it's my stomach burnt her flesh in here. Do you feel her inside you? Now, here's somebody special. The absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. Shows our devotion to the Absolute. These maggots see how strong we are with her guidance. Whole camp will be branded soon, and you should be too. You ready? Brace yourself. This'll sting. Hold still. As pain muddles your thoughts, your minds become entangled. A familiar sensation. She, too, carries a parasite. Darkness seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. The vision dissolves away. You stand before the goblin priestess in the temple once again. into you, a tide of shuddering ecstasy. Her tadpole nestles within that mania, secure, hidden. I feel you in there, digging around. Works both ways. And I saw some weird shadows swimming around in your head just now. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for another. With the Absolute's will, I can fix anything. Let's deal with this in my chapel. It's private. Don't want this lot interfering with true soul business. Oi! Priestess! Like us. We want the mark. Why do they think yeah. they're talking to a god? Aren't we good enough for the Absolute? Perhaps that's how we would have ended up had our Nautiloid not been attacked. Come here. I ain't waiting around. Ready to clear your head.
whatever the absolute tells me to. Don't worry, she loves you. I can tell. Smart. All you need to do is open yourself to the absolute. And I'll do the rest. Don't want anyone peeping on private matters, so... There we go. Secret and safe. Well, secret. Psionic feelers creep across your mind like a pickpocket's fingers seeking flaws in fabric. Sifting deeper, she sees the mind flare holding a wriggling tadpole to your eye. And then the vision lurches, and you are looking through her eyes as a tadpole squirms into her skull. Help! We need to fish that thing out before it eats any important parts of your brain. Don't you worry. I've got everything I need to fix you. Might get a bit messy, though. You won't regret this. Being a true soul, you know the absolute don't like to touch nothing unclean. So drink this. It'll purify ya. Sweet dreams. I'll see your ugly mug on the other side. Wakey, wakey. Don't bother struggling. You ain't going nowhere. The Absolute wants to know all about that critter in your head. So start talking. for talking back. Oh. Can't beat you too hard, though. Gotta keep you alive for what comes next. If I set you free, You'll be sucking out my brains as soon as I turn my back. That creature's turning your brain into broth, boiling away your memories. Do you even know who you are anymore? Maybe that's what the creature wants you to think. It's gonna start eating your flesh, too. Changing you. And eventually your skull will split and you'll cough up a mess of tentacles. Stronger than ever, and I've got the absolute on my side. But you, you're on your own. Nothing more than a skin suit for that monster inside you. You're gonna be my new pet, a ferocious squiddy, all for myself. You test the weight of the chains, looking for weak points, 